Have you ever marveled at the sheer magnitude of these vessels and wondered how long it takes to build a modern cruise ship? When asking this question, you may as well be inquiring as to how much time it takes to create a small city, which is exactly what today's cruise ships are, a floating city. It takes a great deal of planning, effort, and time to build these floating wonders. With an incredible array of amenities, features, entertainment, activities, and culinary restaurants, there are many details that go into creating these modern cruise ships in the cruise industry. Yet despite their sheer magnitude, constructing one may not take as much time as one might think. The time required to create a new cruise ship will depend on the size of the ship and the owner's requests. Regardless of the overall size, the general time to construct most cruise ships will depend on the experience of those building them. Building a cruise ship typically takes between 12 and 18 months. Construction begins with the laying of the keel and is completed upon launch. Modern cruise ships contain all the amenities and features of a modern city. Their focus is on entertaining any passenger on board. Like Las Vegas, these vessels contain movie theaters, casinos, playgrounds, and numerous restaurants. The features and entertainment are getting larger. Movie theaters are incorporating more technology than ever before, and every cruise line strives to be the first in one area or another. They are all competing for people's attention in a highly competitive market. They need to be the best. The cruise company is devoted to providing its guests with the best experience possible. Standard features of a cruise ship include spas, gyms, fitness equipment, and swimming pools. There are also varieties of restaurants available that appeal to most patrons. Where cruise lines try to outdo the other is offering unique attractions to their guests. This may include water parks, mini golf courses, zip lining, go karts, skating rinks, and more. Additionally, there are hundreds of accommodations for crew members, guests, cabins, and staterooms to construct. Cruise ships go through various stages before they're launched. Here are the highlights of the typical steps to construct a cruise ship from beginning to end. Ceremonial steel cutting, this involves cutting the first piece of steel that is part of the cruise ship. It is cut in front of the cruise ship owner slash management.
laying down the keel. The keel is the lowest part of the ship. It is laid down with absolute precision using GPS coordinates to provide accuracy. The process must be correct down to the centimeter to be successful. Launching the cruise ship, once the frame is constructed and cabins are installed, the ship is put into the water. It is floated out and relocated to another section of the company's shipyards so that additional fit-outs can be completed. Trials at sea, insurance representatives and shipyard officials board the cruise ship for the sea trials. Government agency representatives responsible for the shipbuilding will join the group to verify the cruise ship can be sailed. Handover ceremonies, the cruise ship is given to the owner. The shakedown voyage, the cruise ship is relocated from the shipyard to the home port.